is sponsored by Strategic Wealth Designers. For your money tonight, as we've reported, the coronavirus threat continues. Some areas seeing a greater number of spikes recently. European hotspots have pulled back on openings or closed some areas like bars altogether. CBS4's Angela Brower sat down with Strategic Wealth Designers to talk about it. Hey guys, I'm joined today by Mike Reeves. Mike, thanks for your time. With the possibility of another surge this winter, is the market better prepared at this point or would it shoot down again if businesses had to close up shop? Well, the good news would be probably not a total shutdown. The market, eh, maybe it's a little better prepared, but I'll tell you this, small businesses aren't. There are many small businesses that are actually gone out of business other ones are kind of hanging by a thread. So partial shutdowns, certainly, it'll be a problem for the economy. However, you'll very likely have the Fed and Congress come in with more stimulus, come in here and try to rescue this. Just as an investor, just be prepared. All right, Mike, let's say there was a second wave. Are there areas or industries that you think will hold strong? Well, in the beginning, look for everything to kind of fall, uh, much like before. However, you would also want to look for the same stocks that benefited. They're going to come back first. So, you know, technology stocks, they made a lot of hay last time when we had problems, you know, forced businesses to be more responsive online. Online retailers, they also came back first. Consumer staples, some of the fast food um, stocks. The thing that you want to do as an investor, though, if you're taking too much risk, if you fell quite a bit last time, 20 or 30 percent, put some safety nets under your portfolio, have some investments when the market falls, they don't fall at all. Protect yourself. Mike, thank you again. You can always get more financial advice from Strategic Wealth Designers on CBS4Indy.com.